What's up, folks? Welcome back to another episode of whatever this is called. All right, today we're going to talk about Cineverse 2. I just finally beat it. I'm trying to skip the cutscene, but it's not working, but it's all right. We can just talk about it. All right, what I like about it, it was so cool. It's about time travel, uh, Dragon Ball z -ness. If you like haven't seen Dragon Ball Z in years, it's good like remind you. I was like, oh man, I remember that. I never watched the anime ever again because you know you're all right with this. You're sad if I was like, oh, I remember this. I remember this. Oh, by the way, the class that I pick is Majin. Uh, I, I just I hate what I hate about it. What about Majin is that uh, the my ultimate power or whatever it's called, I transfer I transform into Kid Boo. I'm like, what? This guy sucks. So like whenever I'm training with uh, Boo and everything, I'm like, da -da -da -da, like damn dude. I just want to go back to my character, my avatar, basically, because I'm more powerful than this kid, Boo guy. And I, and I did. I just beat him up with my my normal avatar. Da -da -da -da, weaken him up enough, and then transform and just one punch, one punch, one punch, one punch, and then you know complete. And I, I got a Z for that. Unbelievable. Woof. Uh, the story was pretty good. What I, what I didn't like about that is because uh, it's basically kind of the same like Xenoverse one, and just put it in this one, just update it a little more. It's like ah. Uh, if you like Xenoverse 1, you're gonna like this one. Nothing really changed it. Well, actually, it was nothing really changes, but the story changed. It's kind of different. Well, actually, not really, because they attack in the first one as well. But, I don't know. It just, uh, another question that I, it, it's not answered is that, uh, I did everything in the first one. Like, how come I don't mean myself doing it? You know what I'm saying? That'd be kind of cool. Like, you see yourself, like, fighting, uh, uh, uh Namek or, uh, Raditz or something. Namek? Isn't Namek a uh, planet? Whatever, you know, you fight Raditz and everything, da, 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 and you see yourself like, fighting, and then you, in the background you find somewhere else. That'd be kind of cool, like, tie in with the other one, like, two timelines. Same timeline. I don't know if it's the same timeline from the first one, like, from Xenoverse 1, or is this, it's the second one, I have no idea, but... Every time I like, I was like, man, is this, are we in the same timeline? Is this a different timeline? What's happening here? Is it, are we in a different egg, or different universe? Or, 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 it just didn't make sense, okay? It didn't make sense. But the ending was pretty cool. I was like, damn, I didn't I didn't suspect that. This is kind of a spoiler. What the heck? What the heck, uh, Toa? No, it's uh, Mira. What the heck, Mira? You betrayed her. No. It's like, you are always a failure. But I feel like he's a good guy. He just wanted to fight. Anywho. <laughs> Sorry about that spoilers. If you heard or not. But uh, all in all, uh, it's a fun game. Not bad. Uh, I give it a 7 because... It's basically same, playing the same thing in the first one. I think, I don't know if I remember you You play, uh, I mean, there are some different scenes, like this scene right here. Oh, you can't see it. I'm sorry. Like, like whenever, uh, the Majin Saga where, like, uh, where Vegeta sacrificed himself, I don't think you see that in the other one. You, you, there's, like, four different enemies that were in the first one. It was, uh, uh, the Mask Man, uh, the Turtle Guy, uh, the, the freaking, what, I, I don't remember his name. And then Cooler comes in this one as well. See, there's diff four different characters. I probably a picture of the one I can't remember the name. Sigma, Magma, something like that. I don't know. It's just probably a picture. Yeah, the des the design is pretty cool. It's a lot better. Uh, it's better than the first. I was looking back in my, my playthrough of the first one I did back way back. I was like, damn, this one is pretty cool. Another thing I didn't like is that in the end, like when you're almost like almost to the final mission. You have to find your 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 race basically. Like, let's say you're a Majin like me, so you have to go talk to Majin Buu, do his little side quest thing, and then he will teach you a new technique. I kind of didn't like that. I was like, I was actually kind of lost. I'm like, what am I got? What I gotta do? I see the question mark. Like, all right, so it's around this area. Do I have to go in? I wish the game kind of explained like, all right, this is where you gotta do. You gotta go train with your own race. Like at least do that. Like train with your own race. Like, oh, okay, train with my own race. All right, I gotta go where Majin Buu is. Like he's my race. I wish it kind of did that, like, oh, okay, thank you. Thank you for the hip, Grand Kai. I appreciate it. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know, Goku. Oh, another thing, Goku. God damn it, dude. Every time I play with that dude, that dude just beat me. Right now, I'm at level 80, and he still beats me with this stupid Super Kamehameha crap. It's some booty ass, some BS, man. He's like, ah. It's like, oh, no, hell no. Triangle. All right, you got to hold the triangle before you can power punch him, basically, before you can knock you can knock him out of it. If he does it, you're in. Your health, if you're, like, in full health, you're already in your second life, already in your final, you, you know, you get the idea, right? I hope you get the idea, it just, he takes almost all your life, basically, like, half of it, half of it at least. Oh, man, that guy just, every time I fire, I'm like, alright, I gotta fight Goku first, because this guy, I know he's gonna kill me. And after that, maybe Gohan, because he knows the Kamaha too, I don't know if it's the same technique, 
but it's all right. But like I said, if you like the first one, you're gonna like this one. It was pretty interesting playing. I liked it. Uh, would I ever play it again? Probably. Well, actually, the question is, would I play Xenoverse One first? Or would I play that one again? The answer is no, because I could just play this one, and I'm like, all right, I got the idea. I got the idea on that one. It's just a little, a little bit of a continuing story from the first one, but which is also kind of cool. Which I kind of wish I did. Is that I use my own character. Unfortunately, I played this game on the PlayStation 4 instead of the Xbox, uh, Xbox 360. That I played through, and I get my character called Maki. She was a Majin too, but ah uh, man, I wish that she was there. I was like, oh my god, it's Maki! Every time I see her, it's like it's Maki. <laughs> it's like yes, and Maki helped me out, and it was awesome. And damn it, man, Maki, I wish you were there, but I won't. I won't play this again. Unfortunately, if I have Xenoverse 3 comes out, I'm just gonna. Play on Xbox probably. Oh, on PlayStation. Get on the PlayStation for that way I can get this character. Oh, by the way, my my character's name is Alex, if I'm not mistaken. I wish I got like anime name, but so that way Alex and then Xenoverse Three can go up here. I was like, oh my god, that's Alex and Maki. Alex and Maki together. Oh my god, amazing. But like I said, the ending. I like the ending. It was pretty good. The ending was like top notch. I was like, damn, I didn't expect that. Even though I was looking at the walkthrough because I was trying to figure out what the hell I need to do. But I was like, damn, this is, this is, this is, uh, eh, what a great story, you know, all in all, good story. But it just kind of sucks that you've already seen the story a hundred times, because every time you see a new Dragon Ball Z uh, game, it's always the same story going through, uh, from, Dra from Raditz to all the way to Kid Buu. Like, it's always the same thing over and over and over. It, it kind of sucks. It's kind of like, why? <laughs> I guess they can't make anything else. Or, my, or make, maybe make, like, a different Kohen story, I guess, you know, it, uh, doesn't have to be the storyline. If it's a new game, you're like, all right, we're going through the story again. But it's different. It's just RPG. But you know, you kind of know already. It's just a little sprinkles of something new. You know, like a little bit, like a little touch of salt, if you will. But all in all, I like the game. Pretty fun. Uh, I give it a seven, like I said, because it's just like, like the first one. It just ramped a little bit higher. Basically, like first one was like level five, and I was at level ten. That's how good. Uh, I didn't talk about the other stuff that's in it. There's some, something about a chess club, chess thing that you can do. I didn't really get mixed with that. Uh, the parallel quest feels like the were from the first one, mixed with this one just a little bit more, like a little sprinkle, a little bit at least. And like I said about the race, there's like different classes. So all the other classes, uh, Saiyan, Majin, Human, and Namek. That's the uh, race, and you know you got thrift, uh, your fractions, and like you get like inside buildings, and then you can in the outer world you see the fractions a little bit there. Actually, not really. You only see Namek there and a castle, which I don't know where that's from. Oh, also I didn't talk about Brawly. Brawly's in there, so there's five. Oh, Brawly's in there. That's right. That's right. Brawly's in there. I forgot to mention Brawly. I mentioned now because you know, I kind of forgot. And uh, what else was new in this one? Uh, I actually messed around more in this one than I did in the first one. I got like more clothes, uh, outfit. I used uh, Gohan's mask. That's through my avatar. Actually, almost to the first half of the game, I used uh, Grandpa. I got these Grandpa glasses. It's pretty funny. I always laugh like I'm not, my. It looks like my character's not even taking it seriously. It's kind of funny. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. But to the end of the game, I I, I use Gohan mask. I don't know. Actually, what another thing that bothered me is that every time I every time I come to a new timeline, Goku's like, "Hey, you're from that thing. Like, you don't remember me, dude? Like, we, I saw you in a different time. What the heck? I saw you in Raditz. How you not remember over here in uh, 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 Namek? I'm over here now. Like, hey, I remember you. Thank you for the help, man. So I don't know who you are, but th uh, thank you for the help. Like, come on, man. Come on, man. You seriously don't recognize me? You forget? Or you know what they do? Probably no, they don't do that because in the end, Goku helps you out. I guess that'll make sense. What I'm about to say is that, uh, 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 you know, every time we, like, fix the timeline, but, you know, beat, uh, Raditz or, or, uh, Frieza or Kid Buu or, uh, Cell, every time we go back to the Time Nest or whatever it's called, they forget, basically. Like, we've done, we've done the job, we go back, they forget, basically. That's how they, but it doesn't, like I said, it doesn't make sense because in, in the future, he kind of say, hey, what the heck? Uh, I said, oh, here, I'm here to help you out. Like, they're like, Goku, what are you doing here? All right, man, I, I want to repair this guy. You know, I want to repair my my favor. Uh, something like that. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. I'm, 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 I'm babbling right now. What else? Uh, what is, uh, uh, new items. New souls. Well, different. New souls. New souls. You didn't see me, but I'm uh, 
quotation marks. But, uh, what else? Let me see. But, I guess all in all, fun game. So, like, I give it a 7. I would give it a 10. But, like I said, it's like from the first one. So, it's not really, it doesn't count like a new game, apparently. It doesn't count like a new game. It just say, it's, I feel like this was like a DLC. Like a little bit add-on. I didn't mess with the DLC. I, haven't, I didn't buy them or even the first night I didn't buy them. I kind of feel like getting them. It's just no point. Unless it's they're free, I, I play them. But I'm not going to pay you. That's... Eh, I'm not like a huge... Uh, I'm not a huge fan of Dragon Ball Z. But, you know, this game, I like it. Yeah, but a fun game, though. I like the time trial aspect. Anyway. Enough of my ramble. Uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you next episode. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. Hopefully, subscribe. And whatever you're watching, I hope you enjoyed it. Bye, folks. My turn, like always. I'll see you next episode. Maybe it's another anime review, game review, or something I'm watching that I finished, or anything in between. If you, uh, comment below if you have any questions, or, or answer any of my questions. I don't, I don't know. Just comment if you want to. If you like, what do you like about it, hate about it. Sorry if I uh, ramble all over the place and, and you know, it wasn't coherent, basically. Like, it wasn't one... But it was all in different places, some some of them. Anyway, I can mumble on for hours. Alright folks, see you later and have an exceptional day. Stay safe out there, boys.